Okay, we have a Kingston gap bed engine lathe, model 30 inch HR4000. This machine has been raised two inches, so it's an actual swing of 34 inch swing, 44 in the gap by 160 inch centers. We're gonna run it for you. Machine has a D111 cam lock spindle with a four and a 16th inch hole through. We're running right now at a low RPM. You have from eight up to 800 RPM, 20 horsepower motor. Uh, this machine has hardened ground bedways. You see it has a four drawer chuck on the spindle. All right, machine also does have forward and reverse. Machine also does have a new all digital readout as well as a uh, roller type steady rest. He's gonna go a, a bit higher. Machine also has a tailstock and in the tailstock it has a bull nose center. We've got a foot brake which he just engaged, disengaged. Now we're running a little bit faster. Machine has inch and metric threading capability as well. Forward and reverse. Okay, we're gonna go up to the high range. Big, again, here we go. It's threading, engage the half knot. You can see on the DRO that it's moving, it's threading. Okay. We're gonna put it in feed. Now he's got the feed, feed rod turning. And we got the cross feed going, which you can see on the digital readout. And cut. Longitudinal feed. Oh, on the, uh, on the uh, compound, you see we have an Alores DA tool post. Yep, that's rapid traverse. It's a four-way rapid. He's going both ways longitudinal. That's the cross feed, cross rapid, both directions. So you've seen it feed and rapid. Uh, you saw it thread. That's the center, uh, the tailstock. That's one speed and that's the fine one. That's the fine feed. And back there, you see the steady rest. Okay, I think you've seen it all. Thank you for watching our video.